What's up? I am here back again. Okay, so you may be wondering what in the world is behind you, Naomi? Well, um, this is my bookshelf and I wanted to show you guys and then I sat here and then I realized that it's small and like all of my body covers it. Oh, what's there? Oh, I can't see it. So I decided that I would sit here and then I would move Probably that way, because it's like mirrored and stuff, you know? That way, so you all can see my awesome bookshelf of manga and anime and my favorite stuff ever. The only one who wants to know more about Harry's sons I really do think that there's an unwritten story And I think it's time to put fingers to keys I know a lot of people probably want to know more about Grindelwald and Dumbledore I really do think that they both batted lefty And I think there's probably a good story there For book eight I want a book I want a book eight And I want J.K. Rowling to say that the epilogue was crap Cause we all know it was crap And I want J.K. Rowling to say that Voldemort had a son And the story's just begun And I want J.K. Rowling to say That she's writing book eight I know a lot of people probably want to hear the tale. So anyway, now that you've seen that, on to part two. I didn't announce it, but that was part one. But that was part one. Now this is part deuce. And I have something to tell you guys. Remember whenever I was all like, Hufflepuffs? What are Hufflepuffs? This and that and the other thing. Well, I forgot your username. But you commented on my video telling me about all of them. And I was like, oh my gosh, this guy is awesome. So whoever you were, um, you're awesome. Thank you so much for telling me that. Because now my friend has let me borrow. Has let me borrow. Harry Potter! And I've been reading it, it is... It's completely awesome. I am on page 65. No, 67, I think. I don't, I don't, I, okay. Yeah, I think I'm on page 67, yeah. No, I'm past that. 76, I'm on page 76. Because Harry ha has left with Hagrid already, and he, wait. I'm pretty sure everybody else has already read the book, so I don't think that I'm giving any spoilers. And if you haven't read the book, I'm sorry. Don't watch the video. Stop now. Harry has just left with Hagrid, and they're on their way to London. They already got to London. Um, Hagrid's a giant. So everyone's staring at him, which is kind of funny because he's pointing at, like, uh like parking meters and like the things these muggles come up with ho 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 like well not like that but there's something like that and um I think it's kind of funny because he's like this super giant guy and everyone's looking at him like and uh they don't know who he is and it's really funny and um they don't know what a muggle is either so it's like ha oh, you don't know what a muggle is ah, that's you it's you now, Harry is in the, um, Goblin Bank. I forgot what it's called, but it's Goblin Bank. He's there now, and he's going along, you know, in the cart thing, and Hagrid's getting sick in the cart, and they reach Vault 7, where the little, the little goblin is like, he touches it, and the vault disappears, and I was like, mind blown! And then if everybody, if anybody else touched it, they would have been stuck in there forever. Don't miss my goblins. Yeah, that was part two. I started reading Harry Potter, and it's amazing. It's really, really good. Look, I love this paperback. I love it. Look how beautiful that is.
That is beautiful. Thank you, JK Rowling. And yeah, I got my guitar here. Oh, oh yes, part three. This is part three now. Um, recently I just got a spider bite. I got bit by a spider. And this spider, I never saw it, never felt it bite me. Never anything. I didn't even know that I was bitten by a spider till like two days later. No, a day later and then the next day too. Because me and my boyfriend went on a nature hike because I'm a nature-y type person. I like to go outside. I like to be in the nature. And you're like, no, you don't now because you're inside watching YouTube all day and making videos. Mm. I'm just gonna let it ring. Decline. They keep calling me. I don't want to answer. And we get to the end of trail. There was a nice spot of grass. We decided to sit down. Bad idea. Ba very bad idea. Don't do that. Don't do that. Giving its tentacles out and stuff, which was weird. Yeah. I had to go into the doctor. The doctor said I had blood poisoning. I had to get a shot in my butt. Which is not cool, not cool at all. That was an experience. That was an experience. Buddy, anybody that watches this video, anybody at all that watches this video, if you see that and you know, or you are some sort of spider expert that are like, you know, you're all spidery, like, um, can you tell me what type of spider bit me in the comments below? Can you tell me what spider? bit me because I would really like to know I can't figure it out Raymond looked it up and he couldn't all the people that got bit that he saw were like I don't know what spider bit me I never saw it so yeah so um bye this is the story of a girl who cried a river and drowned the whole world and while she looks so sad in photographs I absolutely love her when she smiles